so the, you're you're back. You're you're yeah. you're here. You're again with the the Mass Effects. Absolutely. Um, I did some things. We did uh -huh. some things. Now we're right. gonna be slightly uh, sidetracked. <laughs> You'll, you'll okay. see. I, I have I have a couple of plans in mind because I actually don't want to uh, proceed with the main storyline for a little bit because okay. um well there, there's a couple of things I want to do. There's actually some DLC as part of um, Mass Effect One that is now like intrinsic uh, into the whole like system. How do I zoom? Nope, that's definitely not uh, zoom in. I forgot how to zoom out. Oh no. Controls. How to. Please. No. <laughs> I'm zooming in and out. Uh, okay. Alright. Zoom out. Is that button? Alright. Zoom out again. I'm trying to get to the X57 asteroid. Because this is part of the DLC for um, what was it? Falling Sky. And this is like a whole like different kind of thing. Completely different from the main storyline. It doesn't affect it at all, but it actually loops back around into Mass Effect 3 and helps you out uh, in like the whole like galactic struggle that's going on in the like the climax of the series. So yeah, I'm um go for it. Go for it. Yeah, yeah uh, go for it. <laughs> <laughs> so X-57 is a metallic asteroid originally located in, at the trailing Lagrange point of the gas giant Bohr. With the increased development on Terra Nova, a new orbital port facility was necessary. Due to a shortage of funding, it was decided to mine out X-57, using the recovered resources to finish out the exterior of the Bohr habitation. The asteroid was uh, decelerated from Bohr's orbit using fusion torches, allowing it to fall into the orbit of Terra Nova. Recently, communications with the engineering team on X-57 have been lost. The fusion torches have reignited, and the asteroid is accelerating towards Terra Nova. So, uh, thus begins the DLC. Ooh, okay. Yeah, I decided to kick it off early. Now, who do I want to accompany me? Mm. Well, <laughs> Team Dextro. Uh, it's it's a pretty good solid squad that I have here. For sure. All right. More specifically, because there's things that uh, actually come for this specific for tech users. Status. Sensors reveal three fusion torches propelling asteroid X57. At its current rate of acceleration, the asteroid will collide with Terra Nova in approximately four hours. Analysis. Torches must be disabled to cease the acceleration. Hello. I heard your transmission. Can you hear me? They haven't found me yet, but I can't talk long. Shut down the fusion torches. I'm going to die. God, I hope you're hearing this. Alright, so one of the main things you missed is me driving around like a madman with this thing. Oh boy. Yeah, uh, a lot of this is actually just uh, discovering random points on the map, but it's not super huge, and there's actually a lot of interesting uh, portions uh, on this map that are like challenging for just vehicle exploration in general. So yeah. Okay. Alright, let's see, what's this? Logic arrest tool. I'm gonna take everything because this area is actually littered with really interesting things. Okay. Alright, this victim was badly beaten before being killed with a pistol shot to the back of the head at close range. It's likely he surrendered, only to be executed by his sadistic captors. Hmm. Yeah. There's gonna be a lot of just like bodies around. There's only like a few living people on this thing. We're about okay. to find out why. Okay, so base station three, final entry. Logged by engineer G. Mandel, the guy outside. Uh, the central transmission uh, transmission tower is on the fritz again. 
No one ever listens to my warnings about single points of failure. I'm surprised our surface comms work half as well as they do. When the uh, I don't know how to pronounce that shows up to relieve me, I'll go see if I can get the old girl back up and running. That was the last thing he was talking about. The fact that the communications are so poor. Oh wow. Yep. <sighs> Unfortunate. All right. Let's see. I need the map. I am here. I need to go here. I think. Okay, those are the three fusion torches that I need to shut down. All right. Yeah, you can actually see them in the distance. That's how big this map is, but it's not that bad, honestly. Oh, okay. Yeah. Like, you could easily get to all of these. Huh. The main issue is the actual terrain itself. It's all over the place. So, a lot of driving. I can imagine. Ugh, come on, car, I believe in you. Do it. 90 degree angle. <laughs> God. Well, it is a six wheeler with a lot of power in it, so I guess that kind of, you know, checks out. Also, you know, yeah. space magic. Right, right. Look, a planet. Ooh. E. All right, time to get out. Let's see if I can turn this thing on. There. Oh boy. We're starting off good. I hope I can do this. All right. Uh, come on, come on. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Move, 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 move. Yes. Oh, hey. first try! Data link between the transmission tower and several survey stations has been restored. Survey station locations are now shown up on your map. Perfect. Perfect. Alright, now those red dots on the radar indicate enemies, and I just took out one of the uh, solar panels. I hope they don't need to have power for this station anytime soon. Hopefully not. Mm hmm. Alright, those cylinders are enemies. Headed in the right direction. I don't know who you are, but I'm damn it. Go. Come on. Come on. Open your things. I can't zoom in. Yeah. Alright, alright, alright. There's gonna be a lot of back and forth with this thing. sense to me. Don't make no sense. Mm -hmm. Out here. Ow. There. Hey, there you go. Perfect. Pretty sure that was a tech. <laughs> Boost and to shoot it. Yup. Definitely tech. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> now, let's get in here and see what there is to see. Always a good sign when the game auto saves as soon as you enter a building. Oh yeah, always. All right. Uh, let's see. Garrus, you need to have your assault rifle out. Tally can only use pistol, I think, and I need to do the same. All right. Any of these open? No. Oh, that's a shame. 
And Batarians. Fish dogs. Fish dogs. They look kind of gross, not gonna lie. They're called Varen. Release also. the Varen! Yeah, see, Varen. Okay, I need a heal. Alright. Okay. More Varen! I am overheated. I need to switch to a different weapon. A shotgun that I can't use. Oh my goodness gracious. They are annihilating my squad. I'm gonna die. Oh, save me, save me, save me. Duh, duh. I can't heal. I'm gonna die. No, not like this. Not like this. First death of today. Yes. I. Wow. Okay. <coughs> oh. Interesting. Perhaps it was not a good idea to take this on. Oh well, too late for that. You're in it now. I'm in it now. Can't do much about it. Nope. <sighs> uh, okay, I have to deactivate before I can leave. I didn't realize I was uh, facing the wrong direction. <laughs> Not even dealing with my shields. Ah. All right, so I may have erred in taking on this too soon. I was about to say I don't know if this was the play, homie. Hmm. Might be correct on that one. <laughs> <laughs> 